attention, duelists! If you could all stop staring at my hair for a moment. We are back with another video. What's going on, guys? Today, we have got our order of Infinite Forbidden from Cardbreaker, and we ain't stopping until we pull a quarter century secret rare. Let's go! <laughs> All right, if you guys are new to the channel, you know what to do. Make sure to hit that subscribe button, leave a thumbs up on the video, and ring that notification bell so you stay on top of all the badass stuff we got lined up for you. Much love to everybody who has recently subscribed on our journey to uh, maybe monetize this channel a little bit. You know, uh, it, we're, we're getting there. We're getting to 500 once we get a little bit close to 500 subscribers we'll announce the big giveaway we're going to do a live stream uh that's going to be a fun one we're going to be celebrating big time so we'll be announcing that shortly but uh here we go we got pikaru who picked out the pe the boxes for us and we're going to pull a quarter century secret rare in this video um i'm excited because well, I'm a little nervous. One, uh, we got our decor finally of the White Woods, which we're going to be doing a feature video on that soon because I want to show you the sleeves that I got for this freaking deck. I'm so stoked. They uh, they were definitely bucket list sleeves. But I'm a little nervous because some of these quarter century secret rares are cheeks. <laughs> Big time cheeks. Uh, so I'm hoping that if we pull a quarter century secret rare, it's either something we want or something that's big money. Um, so again, I'm going to shuffle these packs a little bit just to make sure that, uh, there's no mapping in here. Okay. Let's go. Box number one. Let's see if we can open up with a quarter century secret rare in this first box. We're going to do a giveaway today. Of course, we are going to give away a field center from the infinite forbidden, but we're going to pair it with an ultimate rare dark ruler. No more from rarity collection. Number one, all you got to do to get in on the giveaway is make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Leave a thumbs up and leave a comment down below what your favorite archetype out of this set is what you're excited for for the rest of the year and whatever the hell you want to comment. And at the end of the month, we're going to do this giveaway for you guys. And again, uh, appreciate everybody who has recently subscribed to the channel. It seems like uh, a couple of weeks ago, we were in the lower 400s, and now all of a sudden, we're like, dude, we're 450, man. Uh, very, very stoked about it. Took us a while to get there, but you know what? It doesn't really matter because, again, life's good, and we're just out here trying to have some fun. Ooh, I think we got Mimigul Dungeon. There we go. So we got the Mimigul Dungeon, first ultra rare. And uh, that's one that we actually needed. So we need some of the more mim Mimigul stuff. Uh, so we got the dungeon. And that is one that we definitely needed right off the rips. Opening it up with an ultra rare. See if we'll follow it up with a secret rare. Who knows? Because we shuffled this side. So no telling what we're going to get. So let's see if we can get a quarter century secret rare in this first box. Either way, it's going down. Sleepy, woes, and... Mimigul Dragon. There we go. Okay, we got back-to-back -back Mimigul stuff. Does that mean we're going to get a Mimigul Master in this box? So, back-to-back -back Mimigul stuff. We need the Masters because we don't have any Masters right now. Could we get a Quarter Century Master? That would be freaking huge. Let's see if we can get it. Let's see if we can unlock the dungeon. Okay, Rusia. Cattle Scream. Emblema Salvation and Ragnarika Wicked Butterfly. So we got the Wicked Butterfly. Just got a super rare out here. Yeah, uh, very excited about this Mimigul deck. I uh, <laughs> I was kind of bummed because we had a Mimigul duelist at the uh, World Championship qualifier, and uh, they misplayed a little bit. It's uh, that's kind of what happens when it happens to new decks, man. You know, can't hate on the guy. Service and Diabelle, Queen of the White Forest. There we go. That's a solid secret rare. It's not the worst. It's not the best, but it's uh, it's definitely solid. So now we got two of these that we can sell. So yeah, what do you, what can you do, man? So all right, not not a bad secret rare by any means. Okay, all right. Continuing on as we uh, pulled our first secret rare of the side, Diabelle. Which is a solid one to get. Let's see what we can make happen. Looking for that QCR. Woes of the White. Bet and Bat. 
Fiendsmith looking for the Mimigul Master. And we got another Medulce Queen Super Rare. So, super rare there as we are trying to get this quarter century secret rare. Again, uh, the Fiendsmith would be beautiful. Uh, that's the that's the money card of the set. That's the chase pull. Um, that would be the big boy. But you know what? If we got a Mimigul Master, I wouldn't be I wouldn't be too upset. Same with the uh, same with the Whitewood stuff. Medulce Dessert, Fiendsmith Sequence, Aerial Eater. Looking for a second ultra rare of the side, and it's Mimigul Maker. So again, we have. Uh, <laughs> We've hit for some Mimigul stuff so far, so it's got to it's got to happen, right? We got to get a Mimigul Master Quarter Century, or just the Ultra Rare in this box. Let's see if we can make it happen. Rouge Doll, Betten Bat, Celine Snapper, Millennium Moon, and we got the spell card Soul Exchange, uh, Blue Eyes White Dragon. Featured on that bad boy, uh, also very excited about the, uh, we were talking about the quarter century bonanza, and uh, we've gotten some photos that apparently show what is going to be the bonanza. Again, that select 200 count of nostalgia cards and another Phobos Kobos. And yeah, we got some, uh, a sneak peek of what the Japanese set is going to be all about. But we haven't seen, obviously, anything official for the TCG, but they did say that select count of 200 cards that was going to be in the set, um, it was like nostalgia hype. So uh, got a little bit of a sneak peek, Dark Mirror Force right there. So uh, yeah, some kind of nostalgic cards so far. I saw Aqua Mador on there, which is pretty cool because you've been talking about GOAT format, um, some high rarity stuff for that particular format. So looking for the second ultra rare. Could it be here? Let's see if we get it. Looking for the ghoul. Oh, we did not get the ghoul. We got the Dissa Blaster, the negation fortress of 25 cent cards. Okay. Almost one side down. We've got two more super rares to go. Uh, I think we need another arch fiend. So we'll take that if we can get it. Russia and Exode, Fires of Rage. So we got the Exodia action. All right. Last pack on the right side of the first box. Again, make sure to leave a thumbs up on this video. All right, here we go. Side number two, box number one. Looking for a quarter century secret rare. We're on the hunt. We're going to get it today. But we want that Fiendsmith engraver. And we got Obliterate Blaze. So we jumped right to the super rare. So we're getting some Exodia stuff. Um, if you missed it uh, during the second day of the World Championship Qualifier, they actually had the live duel, and uh, we actually uh, were able to record that. So check it out. It's on the uh, it's on the, our page and also left a link up there so you can watch the whole thing, the whole World Championship Qualifier. That was a lot of fun. Tempai Dragon Genroku. This is actually a really good card. Uh, I think it's the last time I checked around like 12, 15 bucks. So... That's a pretty solid ultra rare pull for the right uh, for the left side actually. So Mimigul Master would be perfect. So still waiting for a second secret rare Silo Hat Rabbit. Uh, any of the Whitewood stuff is helpful. Again, we want to get that Racia. Could it come next? Nope, another Phobos Kovos. All right. Yeah, some of the secret rares in here kind of cheeks. We get it happens but uh most of the secret rares in here are doing pretty good we got them all charmy too that's another card that's just been popping off of obviously as we await the new mar charmy that's coming out in rage and we got the beware the white forest super rare so yeah the mal charmy's going hot too uh obviously that came in somewhat clutch over the weekend it just, again just kind of depends on what deck you're facing um but yeah we'll see if we can get this malcharmy here sleepy also looking for a second ultra rare and feedsmith in paradise super rare okay we got about wait, six packs left got six packs or so seven packs on the left side waiting for a quarter century secret rare because it's gonna get pulled today which one no friggin clue but it's gonna happen Rusia. Aerial Eater, 
Service Puppet Play, and Fiendsmith Desiree. So another Fiendsmith Desiree. Pretty cheap card, even though it is kind of clutch for the Fiendsmith package. But that's what happens when your stuff's a super rare. If only our secret rares could also come as super rares and commons. Okay, just throwing that out there. Okay, Cosmo Queen, Fiendsmith. Could we get our second secret rare right here? Nope. It's the Gimmick Puppet Fan Fanatics. Super rare. So we got, what, four packs left? Five packs left on the right on the left side. First box. Got an Ultra, and we got a Secret. Heading our way. Want to see the Mall Charmy? Want to see the Engraver or the Resia? Rouge Doll. Guards. Silvera, Wolf Tamer of the White Forest. Do not need it, but... Good to have some white forest backup. So that's our ultra rare. Four packs, first box. One secret rare. Could we possibly get a quarter century secret rare in this first box? We're trying to will it into existence. Love to see it. Depressed Leopard. Bet and Bat. Come on. Mimigool Maker. Super rare. All right. Three packs of remaining. Let's get this secret rare. Let's get the Fiendsmith Engraver. Fiendsmith Engraver, we're feeling good. Let's go. Reflection of the Millennium. Maiden of the Millennium Moon. Gimmick, Puppet, Cattle, Scream, and... Exode, Fires of Rage, super rare. So, we got two packs remaining. We're either going to get a secret rare or a quarter century secret rare. I'm feeling it. Come on. Make it happen. Here we go. We got the yellow Ajama emblema. Sleepy. And could this be the secret rare? Yes! LZ of the White Forest. All right. So uh, we got another LZ of the White Forest. Look at that miscut. Whoa. Man, that thing's jankified. Okay. You know what? The secret rares, not bad in this bad boy. So the secret rares, we got a double White Forest in this box and we're gonna open this last pack and it is a soul so we got the soul super rare to end this first box all right no quarter century that first box all good we got our second box this is where the magic could happen regardless we're gonna hit for a quarter century today i'm feeling it and i'm feeling the freaking malt charmy I, my gut says malt charmy quarter century secret rare that's what my gut's telling me. But let's see if we can get some craziness here uh, on the second box as we're looking for something a little sweet to start off with. Okay, let's see if we can start off with a secret rare here. Infinite Forbidden. Make sure, again, leave that comment down below uh, if you want to get in on this giveaway. Again, got the ultimate rare from Rarity Collection, Dark Ruler No More in a Field Center from Infinite Forbidden. Let's get crazy right here, guys. Let's pull something nuts right here. Oh, okay, we got a Wedgu Temple. So we got the Exodia stuff. So building up the Exodia stuff. So nothing crazy, but again, um, not bad to have a little bit of a buildup of other stuff. Because like I said, our boy Doan playing some of the uh, Silent Swordsman stuff. Um, also messing uh, possibly with the Exodia stuff. Gollum, the guards, the Millennium Boy. Gimmick Puppet, Mechanix. So another super rare Gimmick Puppet. Quarter century. Where is it at? Oh, yeah. I saw the other day, uh, Ruxin. How many boxes did he open? Like 26 boxes for a $20 card and didn't even pull it. Now, I don't really feel too bad for the guy because, again, I don't think he's got to buy that stuff. Another. Okay. Not the same card, but I was like, wait a minute. Do we just pull the same super rare back to back? Uh, I'm pretty sure he doesn't have to pay for that in the long run because I'm pretty sure he can expense that through his taxes since that's his main source of income still when you just want to pull a freaking $20 quarter century secret rare and you end up with uh, not even being able to get that that's pretty bad Fiendsmith Requiem there we go there's a good secret rare so we got the secret rare Requiem damn near killed him um, out of the right side not the one we want to see but again Last time, both of our secret rares were Whitewoods. Could that mean we're going to get a secret rare of the other 
Fiendsmith card, Engraver, Mimigul Dragon, super rare. Where's our quarter century? Where is our QCR? It's got to be in one of these three boxes. Let's see what we get. Rouge Doll, Benton Bat, Celine Snapper, Millennium Moon, and another Medolce. So that's a playset for the day. All right. Still got a second Ultra Rare on the right side. And we still got to get this Mimigool Master. Still have not pulled one yet. Cosmo Queen, Mushroom, and Quibico. Oh, yeah, that card I can't freaking stand because we pulled like three of them in one box. Um, no more Quibicos. We need the Mimigool Master. want to see him right now. Desperado, Sleepy, Woes, and Mimigool Cerebus. Cerebus, not uh, main deck in that card. Cerebus... Cool Mimigool card. I'm more excited to see what they come up with down the line. I think if you're running a runic type build for the Mimigools, I think Cerebus is a freaking badass. But uh, going more the other route uh, with the Mimigool stuff, not so hot. It's not the best effect that you can get off of the Mimigool cards. But let's see what we end with on the right side here, guys. Looking for the Master. Let me see the Maestro. The Sequence. Eater and the unstoppable Exodia incarnate. So we did get the unstoppable Exodia, and that is pretty freaking cool. Uh, I gotta be honest with you, the Exo the Exodia incarnate, pretty freaking badass looking man. That is a really cool card. The card that uh, Grandpa took Yugi down with. All right, last two packs on the right side. Box number two. Looking for a quarter century secret rare. Gotta happen. And Simple Spoils. Super rare. And last pack right side. Come on. Quarter century. Waiting as we are officially halfway through the opening sequence. Aerial Eater. Strikes. And a Kovos. That's a playset of the Kovos. Okay, here we go. Left side, we're halfway through this opening. Let's see what we get. Could this be it right here? Fiendsmith Engraver. Let's see it. Ragnarica, Snapper, Doll, Treasures, and Fiendsmith in Paradise. All right. Want to see a Master in this bad boy? Okay. Want to see a Malcharmy or... Engraver and a quarter century secret rare. I'm telling you, man. I've always had the uh, I think we've always pulled a quarter century secret rare a tree from the left side of the box. I don't know if I can remember if we've ever pulled a quarter century secret rare from the right side of a box. I don't know, that seems a little weird, but I don't think that's ever happened. Light and Darkness, Dragon Lord. There's a bad boy right there. That's a solid ultra rare. I'm glad that we're at least getting ultra rares that we haven't pulled. Because, again, the um, the Whitewood stuff is mainly ultra rares uh, in terms of, like, the extra deck stuff. And we've already got enough of those. And they're pretty low value. So, at least Light and Darkness, Dragon, we've got a super poly target. Salvation. Woes and beware the white forest. All right, here we go. Almost done with the second box. Starting to sweat, guys. We have not pulled a quarter century secret rare yet, and uh, I'm really needing one. There's a go. There we go. We got Archfiend. That's what we're looking for. Come on. Quarter century or an engraver makes us feel pretty good. If we get an engraver, then we're then I'm all right. We need to get this quarter century. Oh, Fiendsmith tracked. Ah, not the Fiendsmith tracked. We got the Requiem and the tracked, but not the one we wanted to pull. Ugh. Breaking my heart. Getting a little nervous now. We have not pulled a quarter century secret rare. And the second secret rare is a tracked. So we really need to make it up 
make up for it in this third box. Missing Barrows right there for the super rare. Oof. Yeah, tracked. I think it's about a $13 card right now. Mmm. Oh, I need more of this. Alright. Cattle Scream. Some of these cards are banged up a little bit. And Wicked Butterfly. Which one? Ah, cool. Nice. All right, we're going to wrap this tract up really quick so that we can protect this bad boy from getting damaged. So, well, at least the Fiendsmith stuff came together. So, so far, kind of running in groups here. Come on, I want to see the Mimigul Master. And we got the Dark Magician, the Magician of Black Magic. So we didn't get the Mimigul Master, but... We did pull the card that we did tell Doan we would hook up for him. So the Dark Magician, all yours, buddy. So yeah, DM. Pretty freaking sweet, man. All right, we are not getting the Mimigul Master to save our life. And we're not getting any of the secret rares we really want to get. We're down to our last three packs of the second box. And I would really hate to open a fourth box to get a quarter century secret rare because we want to just try to conserve these. And we got the Mimigul room. So we got the trap for the Mimigul action. But I'd really like to not open a fourth box to get a quarter century secret rare. Especially if we open a fourth box and we didn't end up getting one. So maybe if we can get lucky enough, we got the Valmonica super rare for the Lynx. Um, maybe last pack magic on the second box. Maybe. Let's see. Last pack. Second box. Can we get a quarter century? Prayers for the for the poles and, and soul. So no. We are on our third box. We have not pulled a quarter century secret rare. We haven't even pulled an engraver or a mal malcharmy. And that's an issue. That is an issue. One that uh, I'm not too stoked about to be honest with you i'm a little worried now because now we're in our last box not technically our last but last of the ones that i wanted to open we've got two in the weeds then we have to make a decision if we open a fourth one or not and that's at that point almost chasing the dragon and that just makes me a little concerned so bless it up in the chat guys i'm not mixing it up we're just opening these straight up. Quarter century secret rare. Blow it up. Which one do you think we're going to get? Because damn it, we are going to get one. Let's see what we get here. Strikes. Fiend Reflection. And Fiendsmith Desiree. There's our super rare. Whew. Man. Let's go. Gotta, gotta channel this, man. It's been a minute since we pulled a non-guaranteed quarter century. Got the Benton Bat, got the White Forest, Dessert, Fiendsmith, Lacrima, and Resilia, Sinister Soul of the White Forest. Now, when it comes to the Ultras, it's not really that big of a deal because there's not too many Ultras that in the set that are popping off right now. Um, I will say... I do want a freaking do want a master and the Quibico. <sighs> mm. Not these are not the worst by any means, but come on, guys, gotta get something, gotta get a quarter century in this box. Dipsy Fiend, Lacrima, Service Puppet Play, and Cerebus. Of the Mimigul variety. Gotta get a QCR. We'll dip into a fourth one if we have to. Because we're going to keep one saved for the long haul. But I really would rather not. I'd really just rather get a quarter century engraver. Valmonica super rare. Would really just rather get that. Now again, if we pull a, an engraver secret rare, then everything's all right. You know, then you're basically getting your money back for the box. And getting the stuff that you want to get without really having to pay a whole bunch of money. Millennium Moon. 
and we got a Memento Creation King Super Rare. Boy's a badass. Boy is a badass. Okay. Got another Ultra lined up for this side of the box, and we've also got a Secret Rare. So let's make it happen. We got a Quarter Century Secret Rare in here, too. We got it. We got one. Okay, what do we do? Do we wait till the end? Yes. Wait, do we wait till the end? Okay. We're going to wait till the end. We're going to put this down. So we did get a quarter century secret rare. We got one. So we won't have to open up a fourth box. So I'm happy about that. Let's see. One, if this quarter century secret rare took the place of a super rare. That'll be interesting to find out. Let's hope. Let's. Let's hope they took the place of a super rare. Ah, Tales of the White Forest. Okay, not what we wanted to get. We're looking for a damn Mimigool Master. Okay. Just want this measly $3.75 card. But let's uh, let's see if it took the place of a super rare. And uh, let's get this engraver right now. Monster Reborn. Okay. I'm happy we got a QCR. Finally happened. And it happened on the right side of the box. I was just saying, oh, no, we never did this. And then, boom, here it is. So, what the hell do I know? Give us an engraver, man. An engraver right now. Millennium Fiendsmith Sanct. Millennium Treasures. Service Puppet Play. And Dryton Medionis. Draconius. Friskius. Okay. Two packs left on the right side. Hopefully, this one's an engraver right here. Because then we know we got two secrets and a quarter century secret rare. Woes of the White Forest, Bet and Bat, Fiendsmith. Come on. Silo Hat Rabbit. There we go. So we did get a quarter century and two secrets. What the quarter century is, though? I don't know. But either way, we did get Silo Hat Rabbit. So I like that. Silo Hat Rabbit. Hell yeah. This dude's a badass. I dig him. All right. And we got the last pack on the right side, so let's get into it. Last pack on the right side. See what super rare we can get. And it is a gimmick puppet mechanix. All right, here we go. Left side, guys. And then uh, we are getting up on the quarter century secret rare. So we did pull one. Which one will it be? We will have to wait and find out. But we want to see Effect Monster for sure. So Gimmick Puppet and Fiendsmith in Paradise. So uh, Fiendsmith in Paradise. First super rare of the left side as we get into this final box. Here we go. Come on. Fiendsmith Engraver. I want to see him. Aerial Eater. And Silo Hat Trick. This is the quarter century we do not want to see. So we will cry if we see red. But we won't. We will not because we are going to hit for one of the top two quarter century secret rares in this mother bitch. We get engraver. We're doing good. That's a $260 payday. And we're feeling fresh, friendly, and obliterate blaze. So can we get a one freaking Mimigool Master? from this side please i'm asking for a three dollar fifty card out here i ain't asking for much that's all i'm asking for we're also waiting on our last secret rare and we would love to see Resia right now we got soul we got we got liquid goo all over the trash Whew, secret rare it's coming up it's happening is it going to be a money one we hope so Perulia. It would be sweet just to hold a Perulia because I'm more interested in the other Perulia. I'm not really crazy about the one that came out in this set, but it'd be cool to just have one. And we got another Medelche Queen. All right. We're getting to the end, guys. We have um, seven packs remaining, and then we have our final pack with the Quarter Century Secret Rare. Want to see Monster. Want to see Monster. Here we go. Cosmo Queen. Fiend Smith, Dipsy Fiend, and Sinful Spoils Super Rare. Still waiting on my Mimigool Master. Still waiting on the Mini Diabell Star. I think it's going to be the Mini Diabell Star. That's what I think the Secret Rare is going to be. 
Rouge Doll, Gollum Boy, Matter, and Gimmick Puppet Fantix. So we have pulled so many of the freaking Gimmick Puppets. Not complaining. It's cool. We've definitely got play sets of everything, but we're down to our last five sealed packs. Can we get a money-ass secret rare? Drytron. Bet and bat. And we got the freaking wakes from a millennium. So we got the big goofy looking bastard. We, <laughs> we couldn't get a damn Mimigool master, of course, naturally. Um, watch, he's going to... If I pull the freaking Mimigool master quarter century secret rare, I am just going to snap. <laughs> just like, you, it's like, you know, it would almost be fitting and mocking. Like here, you couldn't get the $3 version. So I have the $35 version. So we got the Archfiend. Man. Three packs left. Guys, I'm sweating. Come on. It's got to be something good. I don't think we have anything left. Do we have any? We have a secret left. We have our last secret rare. Sleepy. Oh, Mimigool Room. Jumped right to it. Super rare. Okay. Last two sealed packs. One of them is a secret rare. We want to see the little mini Diabelle or Fiendsmith Engraver. What the frick? Come on. Give us a money card on our last secret rare. Make it so. Oh, Malcharmy. Here we go. Perulia. We got the Malcharmy. Hell yeah, we hit. Let's go. And I'm glad we at least pulled one, man. That is freaking cool looking. I love the freaking foiling on that. Man, Malcharmy Perulia. Whew. Got a money secret. This one was actually pretty good. Still a hat rabbit. They all fit like a theme. You know, we first we got the double Whitewood stuff, and then we got the double Fiendsmith stuff, and then we got like the cute goofy ones with the, the silhouette rabbit and the Perulia. Last sealed pack, and then we're on to our quarter century secret rare. Come on, guys, blow it up in the chat. Give us some good luck here. Service puppet play, Emblema, Millennium Maiden, and Beware of the White Forest. Guys, we appreciate you hanging out. If you've watched this whole thing, let's go. Let's find out what. Our quarter century secret rare is going to be, here we go. Millennium Treasures. <sighs> Please don't let it be dinged. Okay, Drayton. Cosmo Queen. Paralyzing Mushroom, let's peek at what it is. Please don't be red. It's white. Ooh, I think we just pulled the White Woods. Ooh, that is filthy Diabelle Queen of the White Forest Quarter Century Secret Rare. That is clean. That is a clean queen right there. Man, not the best one we could have pulled, but I'll tell you what, as a White Woods duelist, that is freaking gorgeous, man. That's not one I would have purchased. I was really expecting it to just shit all over me with the Mimigool Master Quarter Century Secret Rare, but we got the Diabelle Queen of the White Forest, QCR. Much love to all you guys who hung out. Watch the live stream. Again, you want to get in on this giveaway. We've got a Ultimate Rare from Rarity Collection, Dark Ruler No More, and a Field Center from Infinite Forbidden. Make sure to leave a comment on the freaking video and help us get to 500 subscribers. We're gonna do a live stream, a bunch of giveaways, and we're gonna be opening a product we never opened before, one that we're really excited for. We'll announce that the closer we get to 500 subs. As always, we'll talk to you next time. Till then. Deuces. <laughs> Pipelines.